Hi, welcome back to CES 2012. We're at the Pepcom huge event with loads and loads of exhibitors. I'm here with Seagate, here with David, and you've got two major updates for 2012, early 2012. Can you talk us through those, please? Certainly, so we've got a couple of key products we're, we're talking about here at CES. The first one is our Thunderbolt adapters for single drives. All right, so if you're not familiar with Thunderbolt, it's an Intel technology, primarily marketed and supported by Apple right now, and uh, we've got a couple of products we're introducing here at CES. The first one is uh, a two and a half inch adapter that works with our, um, our GoFlex drives, the two and a half inch GoFlex drives. And basically you just take any GoFlex drive you have that already has the interchangeable interface, you pop it onto the GoFlex uh, uh, Thunderbolt adapter, and you plug into Thunderbolt and you're good to go. The advantages are you're going to get about three times the speed that FireWire 800 is giving you right now. And the reason is that the Thunderbolt connection is so quick. Thunderbolt is a very fast connection. Uh, in past connections, whether it be USB 2.0, 3.0, or FireWire, the gating factor was really the interface. And now with Thunderbolt, because it Even with USB 3, you found the gating factor was the interface. Oh, yes, okay. basically, yep. And what we found with Thunderbolt is you can get speeds up to like a gigabyte per second, you know, theoretically, that's kind of the max, where now the drive becomes yeah. the gating factor. So um, we've come out with single drive adapters that work with our drives right now, and it's a great uh, product to have for a prosumer who, or you know, a consumer, anybody who really wants to have faster transfer speeds, speed up their workflow, um, get product, you know, get their stuff backed up faster so they can get their edit and other things done. And how much is the 2.5 inch version? So the 2.5 inch version is going to be $99. The cable is still sold primarily by Apple for $49, $99, I think, or $50, call it. Um, and this is going to be available in about two weeks from today. And to complement this, you've also got a 3.5 inch version just over there. We do. So we have a three and a half inch version. Right now you're seeing our uh, GoFlex desk for Mac uh, mounted on it. And uh, it does the same thing. The, the uh, retail price on this is going to be $189. Cable still sold separately. And the one key difference I would say is you're still going to get the same performance gains. But this one, because it's powered, gives you two Thunderbolt uh, connections so you can daisy chain from it as well. Right. So basically two very, very quick upgrades for your Mac. Exactly. Quick, yeah. done, easy. And this one's going to be available about three weeks after this, so call it five to six weeks from today. And now we're giving Apple some love. Let's give them some more because you've got an update to your satellite. We do. So if you're familiar with the GoFlex satellite product, uh, it's the wireless hard drive that really is designed for tablets, smartphones, iPads, all those things. So imagine turning your iPad into a 500 gigabyte iPad. Now you have 300 HD movies carry with you anywhere. It's battery powered and, and supplies all your content to, uh, you know, to your iPad or your tablet or your sm smartphone. Well, this has been out since May. And what we found is that we've listened to what consumers have said to us. Is this what we love about satellite? Here's what we'd love to see. Mm -hmm. And we've addressed that. So the first thing we have in a, a software update and firmware update that's coming out in March is we allow you to now connect to the satellite and to the internet at the same time. So on your iPad, for example, you can be multitasking. You can be listening to music in the background from songs that you have on the device, on the satellite, and at the same time, you can be surfing the web in Safari or something. And that'll be a free upgrade. And that'll be a free upgrade for all our customers. Right. And the second thing I'm guessing here is battery life. Battery life, exactly, you hit it. Um, so the other thing that that firmware update addresses is battery life. Most tablets, things have that eight to 10 hour kind of battery life. Uh, initially, we only had four to five hours on this. Well, our engineers have found a way to double that battery life in this next software update. So it's very cool. It essentially uses your tablet as a little bit of a buffer, so you're playing back from the tablet, puts uh, the satellite on standby so you can save battery life while you're using it, and, uh, and really has doubled the time on it. Okay, well, thanks very much for that, David. Thank you. That's two products from Seagate. One is an update to the satellite, and the second is the Thunderbolt connector for 2.5 inch and 3.5 inch drives. Both will be out soon. But until then, wait to see more coverage from CS 2012 on Hexus TV.